Hello, welcome back to the channel. Thank you very much for joining me today. And uh, up at the Western Burt Arboretum, but um, not for the normal sort of photography I do up here, I come here today to test out the GoPro Hero 9. Um, is it still a viable option for 2022 in your kit bag? Now, uh, having just obtained this this last week, it's a good little test for it today. We're up here with our granddaughter, so uh, we're doing lots of running around and lots of uh, shadows and things. So we'll give it a good run, see how we get on, and uh, let's see what the GoPro 9 can do. Let's go for a walk. So the Hero 9 is uh, meant to have had vastly improved stabilisation. Um, bear in mind I've been using the Hero 7 for the last two years plus. So this is going to be interesting. I'm using the same Joby um, tripod as we've always used. Um, so the only thing that's changed is the actual GoPro. So we'll see how good the stabilisation is. Also, a big bonus with uh, the 9 is as has a horizon lock on it. So no matter what angle I turn the camera at, in theory, the horizon should always be where it should be. So uh, good test today because this road's up and down quite a bit. Um, but we'll see how we get on. But, uh, Bear in mind it is still January. Stunning colours and shadows from the sun, which is off to my right. I won't turn you round because it's not overly high today, but it is uh, it's a washy sun. And very deceiving that sky looks beautiful and blue here on the screen, which is about four degrees, I think. But anyway, we've got plenty to walk around, lots to see, so. Uh, Let's keep walking. One of the uh, quite common scenes up here at the Arboretum is beautiful trees like this one in their uh, full winter glory showing us their complete network of branches and twigs etc. Absolutely beautiful looking tree. Now one of the other tests I've got up here today, at the moment I'm actually, uh, the audio on here is coming via the Rode Wireless Go um, through the media kit addition to the GoPro. What I'm going to do in a minute is I'm actually going to unplug the media kit and go on the GoPro's built-in microphone. Now, allegedly that's another massive improvement area on the GoPro 9. Um, so uh, we'll unplug in a minute and we'll go on purely on the GoPro's mic and see how that uh, compares. Now, in its favour for today, there's not a great deal of wind. In fact, there's virtually zero wind. So wind noise shouldn't be a problem, but we'll see how good it is at uh, picking up me just talking while I'm walking around. So uh, next time you hear me, hopefully, it'll be uh, straight on the GoPro's microphone and not uh, the Rode Wireless Go. Well, spring is definitely in the air here at the Arboretum. As you can see, the buds are on the trees already. One of the other things about the GoPro 9 is uh, its stills capability has also improved. Um, I believe on the 7 it was something like 12, 12 and a half megapixel quality and the stills on this one are 20 megapixels so the video I've just taken there of the yellow bush I've also just taken a stills image of the same thing um, so we'll see how good that is as well. Um, so if that's any good we'll put that up for you now as well. Okay, so uh, we're on GoPro selfie mode and we're walking through the Arboretum and I'm actually on the microphone built in on the GoPro now. I'm not on uh, the road of mic at all. Um, so hopefully this is coming nice and clear now. So yeah, it's getting a bit of shade there. Give me two seconds, come back out the trees 
and uh, you can probably hear the granddaughter in the distance. I'm trying not to catch her on camera today, um, but we'll see how we get on. Um, what a monkey. Um, but yeah, it's uh, very, very late winter, potentially early spring. There's not a lot happening at the moment. Uh, a few buds coming through. But, uh, lovely and peaceful, with the exception of the kids charging around, which one we brought one with us. <laughs> uh, dear, but it's a beautiful day, so I'll get out and get some fresh air. Okay, so we've just come round the corner because our footpath has been diverted. Um, unfortunately, I'm suffering with the um, eye ash, sorry, eye ash dieback up here at the moment, so they're doing lots of maintenance on the ash trees. Um, so we've got a diversion round. If you come round, there's these beautiful pines here with the uh, speckled sunlight coming through. So I'm just going to get the big camera out and get a picture of this, hopefully. That's uh, the back of our granddaughter running up to say good morning to the gruffalo up in the woods. And this light is beautiful up here this morning. And uh, just for info, I am now back on the road wireless mic. So if there's a sound quality difference, you know why. And there's the gruffalo in the woods. First impressions here walking all around the woodland is, yes, my opinion, my humble opinion, the Hero 9 is worth every penny. Yes, as I've already said, I think it is a good tool for vlogging with. The biggest positive is that it uh, has the front camera on so you can see yourself to make sure you're well framed up where with the seven that i've been using it's all guesswork you can sort of point the lens and hope it's uh, going in the right direction so i hope you've got some uh, useful info and tips from uh, from this short video about the uh, gopro hero 9 black i yes i think it's worthwhile in 2022 um, and i don't think you'd be disappointed if you uh, went out to get one I'll uh, put all the specs details up for you next. Okay, so this uh, brings us to the end of the video. And uh, I hope you've uh, found some of the information useful in it. Um, just want to say uh, thank you very much for watching. And uh, if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, then please consider doing so. It is free and it just helps the channel grow a little bit. Hit that like button and that will get the video uh, put onto the algorithm by uh, YouTube. And hopefully you let more people see it. And if you like, leave me a comment down below. I will reply to it. I get back to all the people who are leaving comments. Um, so until the next time, stay safe, be kind. Bye for now.